everyone, it's Shayna. I'm here with a plan with me. And if you read the title of this video, you will notice it's a little different. I have my friend Cassie here from Ella Bella Plans, and we are obviously doing a double plan with me. <laughs> so, Cassie, do you want to just explain your planner? Sure. So, I use a medium sized Julio Campania in the color Anthracite. Um, it's just got your basic 25 millimeter rings, and that's pretty much it. And then the guts is a bunch of SM plans inserts on Etsy. So we we have very different planning styles. Yes. We use different sizes. We use different inserts. Um, but we actually both went to Chicago Planner Conference together, and we sat at the Belinda Celine table. Lucky thanks, us. <laughs> thanks to Cassie, because I wasn't going to select. I, I didn't know who to select, and so I just selected who she selected. So... Um, we ended up getting a bunch of swag. She had probably the best table fare. Oh my gosh, it was the jackpot of tables. Mm -hmm. Jackpot of tables. Like, we got a an Erin Condren life planner oh, yeah. with a custom cover. It was spectacular. Spectacular. We got that, um, Ulta bag. Yeah, the rose gold Ulta bag. We got our Disney mugs. Custom Disney tumblers. The whole thing was basically rose gold Disney. It was... Heaven. <laughs> <laughs> Basically. Yeah. So, um, oh, I'm shaking the camera. Um, we got this kit from Plan with Belinda, and since we both got it, and we are both going to Disney separately on the same week, we thought we would do a double plan with me. Yay. So, we're just gonna get into it, All I right. guess, and do our thing. We both plan differently, so... Yes. We'll see how this goes, because we've obviously never done this before. So, <laughs> But you'll kind of see... Okay, sorry. Sorry, I'm going... <laughs> no, I got distracted, because, like, I love your planner. When so. I plan, I take out my weekly inserts, because um, I open up to my month on two page, and I use that instead of, like, putting in sticky notes and such. So... I take out my inserts when I plan. Which is smart. Sometimes. Sorry, I keep... Okay. So, I was just... I was... I have little scissors. I, if you watched my plan with me... Uh... Two weeks ago? Um... I use my... Let's see if I can find them here. I use this little tiny... Scissors. I actually got the idea for these scissors from Cassie <laughs> because of the little scissors that she has. I think they're in there, right? You said they are. Yep, my little scissors. And now I'm regretting. If you see my um, tweezers, could you grab those too? <laughs> uh, I think I saw them right here. Perfect. Okay. So she has these. This is the little twin stars. Yes, and I got scissors. that from Tokyo Pen Shop. So, hers is obviously way cuter than mine. I just got, like, a simple white one from Jet Pens. But I had never even seen this before until she showed it to me. Oh, it's like... There we go. Okay. Um, so, I got the idea for those scissors from her. But mine do not cut very nicely. And I'm having to cut mine down because they don't... Normal stickers don't fit into these boxes. So... Yeah. But they look really cute once you cut them down. Yeah, they don't look bad. I mean, I, if I can't cut a straight line to save my life, but they don't look bad. The kid's so cute, though. <laughs> I'm doing all Disney all September. Yeah, so. and I used a Harry Potter kit for this coming week. Um, it's the first week of preschool for my five-year-old, so... I figured Harry Potter school, obviously. A lot of, I saw a lot of people doing the same idea. I think that's a good idea. Well, and we, we are going to Harry Potter World, so. Yeah, yeah I know you are. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> well, if you need anything at Harry Potter World, though, like I told everybody, you just need to let me know. I will happily grab everything. I don't even know, like, what they have anymore. I don't either. I Like I was telling you, um, we're going to get the boys some wizarding robes, and I would like to get another wand because the said five-year-old broke mine years ago. 
and um, then the Alex and Annie bracelets. But other than that, I'm just not sure if there's a whole lot else that I want. Wait, do they have those at Harry Potter too? Or Harry Potter? I believe so. Well, these are not straight at all. I know. I was just so I've obviously I've never done a plan with me, and I'm sitting here and I'm like, oh my gosh. People are going to get dizzy from me flip-flopping my pages, <laughs> but that's how I actually plan. We are not doing this specially for the camera. We're literally just planning the way we normally plan. Which is so all over the place. Yep. For me, at least. <laughs> oh, darn it. I did it again. What did you do? <laughs> my la this, when I was laying these stickers down, I forgot that I have to cut them down. So oh, I wrote the numbers yeah. in. Before Thankfully, you cut. You should have enough space though. These are stick sticker dots, so I should be okay. Still cutting them down. This is the only irritating part about using these these this size and this type of insert is you can't really make Aaron Condren sized vertical boxes like this. Right. In a pocket size. It just doesn't work. You don't have the width. Right. So I'm thinking about possibly printing these a little bigger. I know. Isn't the hotness right now printing them at like A6 inserts at 86%? Yep. Yep. So that's kind of what I, I'm considering doing. Yeah. It'll be fun to see if anybody starts offering <sighs> dividers in that size. Because that would be... I have some pocket size stuff for the eventual financial planner that I want to put together. But... I would have to use pocket size, like actual inserts, because otherwise the um, the dividers that I have would be too small. Mm -hmm. See, and look, at I cut it too small. Oh, shoot. Do you have, um, uh, like, use the excess sticker? I could. Or would that yeah, drive you true. bonkers? No, no, probably wouldn't. I do. What are the dates? Uh, I have my <laughs> I have my other calendar right here, and I'm like, what's the date? <laughs> Yes. Um, it would be we... the 16th on Monday. That Monday. What am I getting right now? Um. Oh, well, since I'm taking this out. <laughs> said <laughs> planner. This is, you guys, if you've watched any of my other videos, you might have seen this for my financial stuff because <laughs> it sounds like I copy everything you do because this this was just the um, Aaron Condren life planner and we got the rose gold rings and the custom rings. Um, cover and then we also got this right the planny pouch planny pouch is that what yeah Aaron Condren called yeah it? we got this with it too oh yeah. it's not focused um, but I have zero use for an Aaron Condren life planner so what I did was I actually bought the deluxe monthly planner and then I just recoiled it um, and sold it and so now I have the deluxe monthly planner inserts in here um, that I've been using but this is what we got from Melinda Celine and that was really smart I wish I would have thought about switching the coils because I actually gave my Erin Condren life planner since I'd already purchased one for the year to my mom. Oh, right. So my mom has the beautiful rose gold coil and I need to talk to her and make sure she doesn't like chuck her planner at the end of the year so that oh, I can gosh. salvage the coil. Yeah. Oh yeah. Because she is obviously not a planner person so <laughs> she doesn't know that those coils are My important. mom actually got her first like, well it's not like a um fancy one or anything like it's it's still a planner but right. it's like she's gotten the like dollar agenda oh that see your idea worked perfect because that was exactly Yay. the space I needed um you don't put my day here no I put this week because oh. that's that's an even oh my gosh why can't I do this an even amount of boxes so I do this perfect. week so um do, do, do. yeah my mom got her first um planner essentially and it was because I yelled at her <laughs> because... where all the good ideas come from someone yelling at you right, right well she she's got a lot going on with my grandparents and their health right now and mm -hmm. she has siblings but they're in um, New York or the Philippines so it's just her having to take care of my elderly grandparents mm -hmm. and having to also take care of my brother and you know their family with my stepdad and 
her two jobs that she had. That's stressful. <laughs> she started, well, she's, she doesn't watch these, so I can say this, but she started school. Oh, that's awesome. College, she's never gone. So, um, she would probably murder me in my sleep if she found out that <laughs> I was talking about her going to college because she doesn't want anybody to know that she's Aww. going to college. Um, like all the rest of us know, she's afraid of failure. So mm -hmm. she doesn't want everybody to know that she's going to school because if she fails, fails. then she doesn't have to tell anybody. Yeah. But, um, nope, nope, I, like I get that. But, and she almost chickened out. Had a, we, a couple of us had to talk her into it because <laughs> she's just so afraid of failing. College is stressful, man. It is. Well, you know, I tried it again and dipped out. Yeah. Not to mention expensive. It's really expensive. Oh. Um, but yeah, so she, she's, she was actually, um, it's a good thing she doesn't watch these. <laughs> she would be so mad at me for talking about this. She, um, was missing her own medications. And the whole reason she's taking care of my grandparents is because my grandma Keeps. refused to take her medications for an entire year. Mm. And she keeps promising me, oh, I, I won't forget to take my medications. I'll, I'll do better than my parents are doing. And she's she stopped doing. taking her medications because she forgot. Because she was so busy for a while. So I yelled at her. I was like, you need to get a planner. <laughs> you need to, you need to figure your life out a little bit. Start <laughs> tracking. Yeah. So she got a planner, and she, she was like, "That is probably the smartest thing you've ever told me." It's like, well, I'm aware. See, that's why I told my mom to have a planner because she's currently going through um, immunotherapy treatments, and I mean, there are side effects to that. So she's, um, she needs planner too. Same reason. <laughs> Same reason. Take your medications, folks. Yes, or even just to like track her certain symptoms that she does have so that she has accurate information to tell her team of doctors. Right. Well, you don't always remember that stuff when you get to the, I know I have this problem where I have something going on and if I don't have the pain going on when I go to the doctor or whatever it Completely is. Completely forget about it. Oh, I don't remember how to explain what's happening. Right. So that's probably part of the whole, oh, nothing's wrong with you that I always get, but... It just, yeah, so she finally, she finally got a planner, and I'm so happy about it. She looked at me the other day, and she's like, I like this thing. I'm like, well, I know, it's awesome. Everybody likes planners. Right? Or at least you how, should. How can you not, how can you, <laughs> you should like planners. Yeah. How can you not like something that keeps your life together? Right. That's why they make tools. Right. My gosh, I'm like so nervous. I'm gonna lay something down crooked. I'm shaking. Oh no! <laughs> I could like see my hand start to. Is this like the angle that you normally plan it? Actually, yeah. I'm really surprised that this isn't um... uncomfortable. Yeah. I've gotten used to planning at this. Ang I guess I kind of plan at this angle anyway. But being that I've been doing these plan with me's, I'm kind of used to this angle now. Okay, so for the next day, do you think I should do the run to the castle or the ears? Kind of wondering. I was going to say the run to the castle. Yeah. I think that's what I'm going to do. Because there's a lot of that mint right there. Mm -hmm. But I want to leave enough space so that I have, like, I can write, like, the favorite memory of the day, I guess is what oh, I'm kind of yeah. going for. Um, Because it's just like your little guy. It's my boys' first time at Disney too. Mm -hmm. So we will have, we, well, we better have. I've warned them if you guys are sassy at Disney, Mickey Mouse will not let you come back. Ooh. Yeah. I would warn mine about that, but he would not give a single care because he's <laughs> too little. He's like, I don't know what you're talking about, Mom. Okay, Mom. Whatever you say. <laughs> uh, let's do it. See, I don't understand how I can't ju judge this right. Whatever. I will just make it work. Did you, I just, I think I just talked about this a couple videos ago, but did you ever watch the first season of Project Runway? 
No, I, um, well, I know I have, but honestly, I was in high school, I think, when I would watch it. Yep. Um, I am so picky about shows. <laughs> So, if I did watch it, I wouldn't remember it. <laughs> so there was there was um, a guy on the show named Andre. Mm -hmm. I think it was the first season. And Tim Gunn would always, where's Andre? Where's Andre? And, you know, like his, his saying that he always says is, make it work. Yep. So there's this one clip of one of the other guys on the show mimicking Tim Gunn going, where's Andre? Where's Andre? Make it work. Make it work. And so every time I say make it work, you automatically think of... I always go, where's Andre? Make it work. Every, every time. It's embarrassing a little bit. <laughs> hey, but if there's any, like, hardcore Project Runway people, they'll be like, yes, Shayna. Yes. I haven't watched that show in so long, but I used to really like it. I don't, I don't really watch TV anymore. Uh, Brandon and I do at night, once the boys are in bed, we do a lot of movies before, um, bed or like as everybody's winding down, mm -hmm. so the TV shows wait until the children are in bed. Okay, so it's just me. <laughs> well, I guess I didn't even cut it crooked, I just cut it a little short. No, I think you're so, pretty perfect. Maybe it was the scissors, maybe I can believe it on the scissors and not me. I think that's accurate. Hopefully. Because those scissors are so small and they are, I don't want to say they're flimsy, but they definitely aren't like as sturdy as regular right. scissors. So right. I could see them being like, I keep them in my pen pouch so they get jostled around a lot. Mm -hmm. I can definitely see them kind of becoming unstable. Right. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Do I like plan out what we're going to be doing or hope to do? What are you doing? So I am not. <laughs> I'm just laying everything down and then as the week comes about I'm going to fill things in. What you is did. my hope. Yeah, the night of, like kind of my wind down time mm -hmm. as we're um, at the resort. So uh, this is probably all I'm going to be doing. And then I have um, these month once more with love's stickers that I'm going to use to decorate the day. I think I have those And too. then I do also have some um, for the days that we're at Universal Studios, even though I'm using the Disney kit, I do have a lot of Harry Potter accents that I'm going to be adding into. Right. Yeah. So. I have a lot of Disney. I have a lot of Disney stickers. You were prepping all <laughs> year for buckets. these Disney spreads though. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to go through these because I might as well. Right. Um, so this is the Smush Peach. Also the Smush Peach. One of my favorite stickers. These two, I think, are my favorite Disney stickers. The ones are adorable. They are. They just don't look up. Um, this is Shine Sticker Studio. I don't know if I'm going to use these this week, but we'll see. I have two of those. I may use the boxes, I guess. Like these ones? Maybe I'll use those. Yeah, you could use those to mark what park you're at. Yeah, that's true. There's, all, there's four. Well, I can use the other ones, too. I am not going to use these this time. I have these from Banana Doodle Shop. I left my heart at Disney. I'm going to use that on the last day. I have that same um, Once More With Love. Did you give me this? Somebody I did, this. yeah. I actually won a giveaway with Once More With oh, Love. That's right. And so when I ordered, um, I grabbed us each a sheet of those because I knew we were both going. Um, bookish planning. I. It's not even focusing. <laughs> you could do this. So if you didn't, I don't know when it lost focus, but... Just go back. There's the other. <laughs> there's the other. I think the other ones were fine. Yeah. Um, but I love Bookish Planning's um, character name. It's Paige Turner. Oh, that's adorable. <laughs> right? <laughs> so I've got a couple of those and the Magical Castle. I'm not going to end up using all of these. Snacks, obviously, because the snacks are the best part. I'm so excited. That is the one thing that I don't remember for any of my Disney trips, the snacks. And I don't yeah. know why. I, I never did. Them. I don't think we did any, really. Um, I have another one somewhere. I think it might be in my stash of bigger stickers. Yeah, I have a lot of Disney stickers. I We booked our trip in February. So... 
we've known about this since mid-February, and I've basically been stockpiling stuff since. That's a good idea. So, I wonder if I can find that other sheet. What was that? Um, just a crooked sticker. I think okay. I fixed it. <laughs> Did you leave something to What happened? Uh, yeah, basically, a uh, crooked sticker. So naturally, you have to like gasp. Of course. When you put down a sticker, crooked. Oh my gosh, where did these stickers go? I have so many sticker books. It's not even. It's just. Are they all filled, or do you put a little bit in each? A little bit in each, but two of them are filled. I have five of the standard size. One that's a little bigger, one that's much bigger. But yeah, they're basically all full. That's not what I was looking for. You're gonna have your whole thing done and I'm not even gonna be like halfway. Oh, don't worry about it. I am currently trying to see if I can fit the Fox and Pip Girl over um, so I don't know about you, but I always, so a lot of shops do like a little icon in the bottom, yep. but I not always, not that I'm not a huge fan of the Disney castle, but since we're actually going to Harry Potter world, I want to oh, yeah. cover. So that's what I was kind of well, that's eyeballing. Smart. Here's the other one that I was looking for. So this is also from the Smush Peach. Snacks. Yep. So I'm excited for all the snacks. All the snacks. So I am ready and prepped. I guess since technically this video is going to go out after our trip, um, I can actually show this now. So I don't really want to take it out. <laughs> um, I'm using this um, weekly. I don't know if you can see it. It's kind of light. But this weekly from Peanuts Planner Co. And this is how I planned out our trip. So I have like the parks that we're going to hit up, the hours that the extra magic hours are. Um, the black is kind of like other things we're doing, like the flight and Disney Springs. Um, the green are any dining reservations we have, and the purple are any fast passes I've booked. Although we probably won't use most of them. But oh, that's really bright. You probably can't see it at all, but that was smart. Too. Yeah, because right? you've got the times and everything in there. I I won't be bringing this. I'm not planning on bringing this to the parks, but I am gonna have it with me because Available. I cannot. I cannot go anywhere without this thing now. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I know that's. I'm definitely my planner is coming with, but it will not be on me. Right, that's where they're. I will have my micro with me. Oh, that was so cute. That was, that I'm, was is. I'm really excited to use that. I guess I'll, I'm gonna um, do a how I used it video Ooh. for that after the fact um, to see if I even used it at all. <laughs> I'm assuming I'm going to be using it yeah. because... Are you using it for autographs? Yes. Yes. I actually found my old autograph books because I had two. Oh. And so I have... I'm just going to let the boys kind of continue on what I had already started. Oh, that's awesome. Oops. So I actually... It's so funny because I do have a monthly, but I don't use it to plan with. What do you use your monthly for? I do, because, like, obviously I have some stuff marked. Yeah. But I always go to my phone. I do no planning on my phone. I put everything in the Google... Google I can't say Google. I swear to you. <laughs> everything in my Google calendar, because then Pat can see it, too. And he has no excuses for, for not, not knowing. knowing. Yep. I was expecting a smart comment from downstairs, but he must not... <laughs> Be listening. None yet. Okay, so we are 
Oh, that's perfect. I'm going to... I have, there's four of these bottom stickers here, and we're going to the parks four days. Perfect. There we go. I was going to get, like, actual park stickers, like, pretty sheepy. It has some really cute park stickers, but I ended up not getting them because I figured I had enough Disney stickers to make it work, work with what I had. Yeah. kind of regretting it, though, because they were really cute. But by now, I won't get them in time. I do a lot of back and forth because I <laughs> try to make everything super cohesive. Right. Which... I'm going to have to cut into that even more. That's not too loud, me banging all my tools around. <laughs> this is my first plan with me, so I can't tell you. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's a lot. Oh, geez, see, and I cut it down too much. Gosh, darn it. <laughs> Live and learn. I, I don't cut it down enough, and, and then, then I trim much. it just a tiny bit, and then it's too much. Do you... Uh, suggestion or an idea. Could you cut down a piece of washi, stick the washi oh, down on right. a piece of sticker paper, and then, like, pre, like, I don't you know if it'll work that. today, but, like, pre-trim? Right. You did say that, not too If long you ago. decide to keep in these inserts for a while. I think I'm going to, because they're, like, I am, I'm jamming on stuff in this. Yeah, and don't, don't fix what's not broken. <laughs> Unless you're Might super, yeah, unless you're super, <laughs> like, uncontent. Right. No, I think, um, I think you don't want a Hobonichi scandal like mine. <laughs> I, I was just waiting. I was just waiting. Yeah. Waiting for the day to come. And, and it then wasn't it came. even, yeah, it wasn't even the Hobonichi weeks. It was the A6 size. It wasn't even the, the hot planner that everybody was using. I don't know. Um, like why well, I got into my head, but I will say though, these inserts that I'm using are a lot the like layout. It. Yeah, yeah. They are the layout. So the layout worked for me. The bound system does not. Well, I maybe next time I'll actually say something, but I was gonna be like, "What are you what doing? Are you doing? <laughs> like, this is not like normal for yeah. you." I know, the entire year I was flirting with the bullet bullet journal system. The entire year it was, like, I used the B6 Stology for a little bit. I used the A6 Stology for a little bit. I used the Hopanichi Techo for a little bit. And in between all of that madness, I was still loving my personal rings. So I just need to stick with personal rings. That's been the one thing that I've gone back to... The entire time I've been planning for the past five, um, seven years, 2015 is when I, I didn't, I wasn't a part of the planner community, but oh, that's you were? like my first EC. I was a lurker on Instagram for a really long time. And then, um, I don't want to say I got out of planning, but I stopped checking in on the planner community throughout 2016 when Colby was born because, um, he was born premature, and it was just like social media time wasn't something that I yeah had. you had other priorities. I had other priorities. I had other things that I needed to do. So, um, and then I don't I don't even know when I really started my planner Instagram. I think it would have been twenty seventeen was when my did seven, you hide any of your old your initial posts? Because they still be there. Oh, I um. I don't think Oops. I've hidden any of my posts, so I can figure out when my planner Instagram started. But I did delete all of my planner photos from my actual, like my personal Instagram. Mm -hmm. Um. So, but my EC was from 2015 because I do still have that my original EC. Wow. Oh. But I knew I had a personal. Although I still have my, I, I still have my um day designer <gasps> that I bought. <laughs> do you? <laughs> It's downstairs. I actually want a day designer giveaway, like a, a one of the really nice ones, mm -hmm. and I used that for a good while, just for work in 2016. 
I think I'm going to copy you because for some reason the angle I'm writing at right now to stay in frame is not happy with my hand. So I think I'm going to set my planner aside like you were doing and uh, just do this. It's really bright now. <laughs> It's all the white paper. Yep. And the pastel colors. So... You know, the one thing is, though, we do have different planning styles, but I feel like... Um, I think we prefer different sorts of doodles. Yes. But our colors are always kind soft of same. pastels. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. I'm trying to think of how I want to do... I'm a little bummed that there's no glitter headers. I just that noticed. is the one thing with this kit. There aren't headers. Yeah. Well, do you, there's... Do you need headers? I have some Fox and Pip these. bow headers. But the other thing that I thought maybe are meant to be headers are these washi strips. I think yeah, they're a little true. thicker, but... That would work. That was my original plan, but then I just decided I'm not writing to-do lists, so I don't need headers, and I just started laying down washi. See, I just don't, for some reason, I don't understand why I don't like just having this here. I like having a glitter header on top of it. I know. Right here, I've mm -hmm. been playing around with that, and I'm kind of, like, I will see if by the end of this week if I really hate this extra space here. Mm -hmm. um, I usually, but though, I've been doing headers, so I, I feel you on that. I don't even know if I have, like glitter you know I cleaned my office do you need in what kind of foil do you want do you want five millimeter bow washi I have some okay yeah I'll see if I have any other life no I cleaned my office because we were planning on doing um like a picture in picture so we were actually going to show our faces but it didn't end up working out with the setup that I have because I don't have like a super professional setup looks kind of professional though like <laughs> I don't know <laughs> it, we were propping we were propping a video camera up on my 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 trimmer my laminator and a foxy fix box <laughs> okay fine maybe that part wasn't professional <laughs> but um it wasn't really working so uh that's why you're just getting our lovely hand here we go back in action back at it um, weekend banner, that's what I was doing earlier. <laughs> I just told you what my plan was and I'd already forgotten. So, Sunday. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. I'm going to want to get some stuff done on Sunday like you just said, so oh, I hadn't yeah. even thought of it, but I'm going to do that. I'm probably, it takes me a while to unpack. So I'm probably not going to be un fully unpacked. I've never had to unpack for myself and then two others, the boys. So oh, it will be a little, it'll be interesting to see how long it takes me to unpack and do all the laundry. Mm -hmm. um, I already have a good game plan in place on so leaving the house well off so that when I get back I don't have a bunch to do. That's always like, that's always I think the best way to do it even though sometimes I haven't done it. Is just power clean before you leave. Yep, everything should be in perfect shape by the time I leave. That way when we come back, all we need to do is pick up our dogs and then... Unpack and laundry. Unpack and laundry. Laundry is going to be the, probably the death of me the week after, mm -hmm. especially with school. Although it might be best because then I don't have um, Kate to entertain and Colby will more than likely be so tired right if he won't want anybody talking to him he'll just want to chill out in his room exactly he's not can i do that? he's not gonna want people <laughs> yeah i don't want people either but i have to go to work right but that's like every day so if i cut this down I kind of wish I would have moved that more towards the middle. Oh, well. I wanted to cover up the time. Oh. It'll be okay. I'm trying to think now. Should I put down any deco? Actually, 
I might be almost done, potentially. All right. I think I'm good. I put everything down that I'd like to. I used all of my deco stickers that I wanted to. I haven't used a single one yet. I'm actually going to, I'm going to put a full box sticker on Saturday. I don't use a ton of full box stickers. I may on these days just because mm -hmm. I, I'm not going to be doing any to-dos or anything. Right. That's, um, well, I, I'm in a larger planner than you are. So right. I always put down full box stickers or I try to. Uh, when I use leftovers, I when I use leftovers, I really utilize the washi strips that a lot of kids come mm -hmm. with. So I actually might do my little washi trick while I just sit here. There you go. Because uh, I've been doing it with these big washi strips. Just taking them in and then cutting them down to that EC box size. That way, when I do a leftover kit week. Yeah. They're already cut down, and I don't have to worry about it. That is so smart. <laughs> I know. I can't believe I've never really seen anybody do this before, but it cuts down on so much time, and it makes it so much less frustrating. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, yeah. I would, I would imagine. Because these Disney kits are awesome oh, ones. Geez. Although, I don't, mm, I don't know if this will make a good leftover kit. Only because when I didn't use, use the Magic Band. Oh, and I don't think I necessarily want to use that. Because the Disney kits are nice for when it's the boys' birthday weeks. Mm -hmm. But the Magic Band, that doesn't really make sense on birthday week. Yeah, that's true. We'll see. I'm in such a use your stash mood, <laughs> I might just use it. Just use it anyway? Yeah. I tried to figure out all of my kits for October and November so that I didn't have to buy any except for Christmas kits, and I think I have everything figured out. So, people, Christmas kits, I want them. <laughs> <laughs> I am ready for them in September. Hey, you I know maybe what? should have bought some Christmas in July kits. You know what drives me insane, and I apologize if you're the kind of person that does this, I guess kind of, but not really. Uh, not you, I meant whoever's watching. Oh, that's um, fine. I can't stand it when people complain that Christmas stuff comes out so early. Yeah, I feel like those are the people that don't go overboard with the pre-planning. Right. And I will fully admit I go overboard with pre-planning, but uh, Oops, with all of the different family, because I come from like a split family, it's, and then, you know, of course you add in my husband's family. There's already so much planning to do for Christmas. I try to start in September at the latest. Right. Because otherwise it's just, it's too much. Well, even like decorations, I, I, I appreciate that stores put them out so early because it means that I can budget. I don't have to buy all my decorations at the last minute and use up a chunk of my Christmas gift money. I can buy them in September, October, November, and have them ready for December and not have to put a huge chunk of decoration money down. Right. So I really appreciate that this stuff is out early. Halloween stuff, like any kind of decor and stuff, I love that it comes out so early because it just means that I can budget and plan for it and not have to spend all my coins at one moment. Right. And I don't know about you, but I got so much... Um, I don't want to call it leftover decorations, but like my grandma and my mom really purged what it is that they had mm -hmm. or updated their style of what they had. And so I got a lot of what they did have. And it's nice for certain things, like if you remember something from when you were growing up. Yep. However, a lot of it is not what I would like to have in my home anymore. Right. Um, it's not necessarily my style. And... I've done that for this fall. Um, I'm going to ask my sister if this one thing means anything to her, and if not, it's going in the donation pile. Oh. Because I have a pile, because I still haven't gotten rid of that stuff from within last year. It's still sitting in my office, but that is my project for this coming school year, mm -hmm. is getting that pretty. Pretty and what I want it to be. I don't, 
Oh shoot, I didn't want to do that. Um, I, I don't know. I, I am probably one of the laziest people I know because I, I have decorations and stuff, but I don't even know if I'm going to put them out. It's so fun to, but I don't like taking them back down and then they sit here until halfway through the next year. Yeah, I, oh, okay. <laughs> Slight freak out. I'm like, I didn't put down Kate's school times. We are not at school this week. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I love these off on a tangent here, the Coffee Monsters Co. little pencil stickers mm -hmm. to put down when For school. Yes, preschool. I definitely feel you on that though because I put out all of the decorations and for fall and I did that September 1st and I also Halloween yep because if I only do it at the in October it's all of that work it took me all day yeah for a month yep and then it's going to take me another you know all day to take it down get everything dusted off and cleaned so um I definitely understand where you're coming from on that. I, that's why I decorate so early and I have it for so long because mm -hmm. honestly, come the middle of November, I will be begging Brandon to let me put up Christmas. <laughs> he doesn't like that I do that so early, but at the same time, he now has seen the work that I do to get it nice like that for mm -hmm. our family. So I feel like he's a little more lenient on when we do that. Right. I, last year, or two years ago, it was, it was my kid's first Christmas, we actually hosted um, Pat's family here because we had the baby and we didn't want to go out driving. So we offered, we have a house big enough to house everybody, so we had it here. And I, because, you know, he was six months old at the time, um didn't put the decorations up until two nights before yep. <laughs> two nights before and we kept them up for I think two weeks after that and then took them oh down. for sure Christmas decorations I don't think I took down until the end of January last year mm -hmm. granted Brandon was sick that year but um or not sick recovering right I did not want to take those down at all. They stayed up for a good long while. I think I There's a squirrel on the it. fence over there. Oh, <laughs> it's it freaked me out a little bit. Yeah, it's a big squirrel. That's a big squirrel. <laughs> oh my god. Look at him go. <laughs> yeah, he's like it's like I know this fence. <laughs> Just caught me out of the corner of my eye. I'm like, what is that? I am almost done. I'm. I keep looking and trying to think. Are are there any deco stickers that I need to put down? Not need. Want. I want to put down. Need. We'll just <laughs> need. Do I have? I haven't even used any deco stickers really at all. Hmm. Will you? Um, so obviously we are pre-planning now, but yep. will you back plan? Oh yeah. Well, I'll actually probably, what I'll end up doing is on Monday night, before I go to bed, I will probably put in here what happened. Yeah, see, that's that's exactly my plan. I almost wonder if I should, because right now, um, I keep a sticker pocket full of my fall stickers, mm -hmm. so that I can put those down. But when we go to Disney, I might change this out. Oh, yeah. With just my Disney, Disney and my Harry Potter stickers. Yeah. That would make sense. If I, I mean, remember to do that. I'm not going to probably bring a ton of stuff. I Now that I'm in this Julio, I do not need to carry as much with me anymore. Right? Mm -hmm. I, I, yeah. I, feel, I don't feel like I need all the things anymore like I did when I was mm -hmm. in my Foxy. For some reason, I don't know what the difference is. I only carry around... My Gilio and my pen case. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Um, that's me too. I, that's all I carry. Occasionally I'll throw in a roll of washi. Honestly though, the only roll of washi I bring with is this 
spotty mm. washi because it's my favorite, which is why I have three rolls. That's actually my second roll that I'm on, and it's obviously much smaller. <laughs> I, I'm getting honest, nervous because I only have like two unopened rolls <laughs> left. Like, oh my gosh. So this is my pen case. I don't even need this. What? I don't even need but it. But you have the two pen loops. I on do. Your... I do. Yeah, because that gray mild liner, that's always my favorite. I have two yeah. of those. Well, I don't know why I put it in there, but yeah, these are the only the only pens I use now. That's it. I am loving the Uni Ball Jet Stream though. And I know we've talked about it, like you don't like how the I have not, I think I've written with one and I like yeah, it. This this is the one that came with the Hobonichi that I bought that didn't work mm -hmm. out. And then I have another one. Um, I don't know what it is about it, but I'm really liking it. Although I did use my Coletto the other day for my grocery list and I did miss it. <laughs> for a hot minute. I was like, ooh, that gel ink <laughs> <laughs> does something to you. I can't, I can't with ball pens anymore. Um, although there is this one pen I have at work um, that my coworker bought for me. It is a ball pen, but it is like the smoothest ball pen I have ever used. Like it feels like gel, but it's a ball pen. See, it, that's I like it a lot. That's kind of how I feel with that Uni Jetstream because it is that a hybrid ink that's in it. It's no, not gel. No, it's, it's not, a ball pen. It is ball yeah, pen. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm loving it. <laughs> I'm gonna be using this one for my flight. I don't know if this will actually show. No, it may not. Okay, maybe I'll do this. This one. The frustrating, oh. frustratingly packing one. That's what. <laughs> that's gonna be me. Are you bringing an empty luggage? Um, I think my mother-in-law is. Okay, that's. Uh, we came up with our game plan. So each of our boys has a carry-on. Yep. And then they have backpacks. Yep. I will have my handbag and no carry-on, but I will have the regular suitcase. Mm -hmm. My husband is packing his things in our carry-on, and then he has a backpack. And so um, the suitcase, though, that I'm checking is basically going to be empty. Mm -hmm. So our actual suitcase will be empty, and then all of our stuff will be in Brandon's carry-on. I think, actually, you know, we just talked about this, and I think we may be... I think... Pat may be taking an empty suitcase, possibly. I forget. But otherwise, my mother-in-law will... It's going to be um, the three of us and then my mother-in-law that are going. So she's already, I think, got it planned to have a separate suitcase just for souvenirs. That's good. So, thankfully. That was the one thing I... The last time we went to Disney, it didn't really account for souvenirs. Mm -hmm. And then all of a sudden, it was like, where is this all fitting? How do I get this home? <laughs> yeah. How do I How do I make this work? Okay. I mean, honestly, this may be the only sticker sheet I bring with me besides, like, the kit. Isn't it? I, I am obsessed with that sticker sheet. It's amazing. Like, it's so cute. Oh, I didn't even notice that there were page flags on this. They're really... I didn't end up using those, but I think I might... Um, as we do, like, I'll put down what, if we did stop to eat anywhere, right. I'll put a page flag down on the times to kind of block off, but. I'm going to use, I, although I don't think any of us are going to get turkey leg, because I don't think they offer, I'm going to put this at Be Our Guest. <laughs> yeah, but it's like, seriously, when else are you going to use, when else are you going to use a turkey leg sticker? Like you said, maybe the Renaissance Festival, but I'm It kind of makes me think of, because it's Be Our Guest and Beast, well, Beast is <laughs> there for dinner, but, and we're going for lunch, but still. I get it. I get it. I may be done. Yeah, I'm good. I've like paged through a few times. I I think I'm good too. I gotta put a coffee sticker here. <laughs> That's why on um I think on yeah, Sunday I have the big full box coffee. <laughs> Oh, I didn't even notice that was a thing. Yep. <laughs> Should've used that. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely gonna be a thing. Um, and isn't there... I thought there was like a... a sad sticker somewhere. Don't I have a sad sticker somewhere? It was the... Oh, I do have it. Yeah, I used it. Okay. I love my heart. Yes. Okay. I am just gonna keep flipping through until I say I'm done. So I'm gonna say I'm done. Oh, that's probably my favorite favorite week so far. I'm really happy. I So I know I said before I wasn't sure if I'd like that space at the top, but I do kind of like 
I, it's I, nice. Yeah, I do like it. It's I like a visual break. With, right. I might do that with more weeks. Okay. So. Yeah. That's our, uh, our co-Disney weeks. Yay. I'm so Slash excited. Slash Harry Potter. <laughs> yes, for me. I'm, oh, I'm so excited. I'm, I'm excited for Disney World, but Harry Potter World... Yeah. <laughs> With the park hopper passes, I can take the Hogwarts Express. Like, uh -huh. I am so excited. We we went last year, or last year, last time, and we thought it was like a one and done, because we were able to go to both. Right. And we were like, oh, this is a one and done. But now that we're going down there and we're not going to it, I'm sad. The, ca the, the Hogwarts Castle. <laughs> it's, like, it's, it's so amazing. <sighs> takes our breath away. <laughs> we actually, we walked through it. We didn't ride the ride in there, but yeah. you can actually walk through yes. the castle. So mm -hmm. we did that. But I think, oh, I think that's all I've got. So, yep. That wasn't so bad. Yeah. Thanks for having me on. Thanks for being here. <laughs> Not oh. like you had to drive super far at least. No, thankfully we're only like half an hour away from each other. So what do you think? What do you think of playing with these? It was actually a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. I was worried I was going to have to like go around all of this equipment and get <laughs> super frustrated. The only thing is like I am going to watch this and see how much I flip my inserts back and forth. Yeah. That's what I'm worried about because I totally turn it around to get the right angle so I also don't I. Yeah. lay down a crooked sticker. Yep. And I've never noticed it when I've watched your plan with me's, but I have a feeling I do it more than you. <laughs> I wasn't really... I know. I don't yeah. think I noticed. So but. it'll be interesting to play back, but I... It it's fun. It's a little It's a little more difficult when you're talking by yourself. Because what do you... Well... <laughs> it's hard to come up with things to say when you're just you. Yeah. my but. my. I'll have to take like tips from my husband because my husband talks to himself all the time. <laughs> I'll be like, um, what was that? No, no, it wasn't, wasn't uh, it's, for I you. I wasn't talking to you. It's like, okay, so you were talking to yourself? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. <laughs> Oh, okay. Does he answer himself? Uh, I haven't noticed that. I okay. feel like I would notice that. I, I can't. Not I'm not yet. even going to deny it. I answer myself at work. I'll ask myself a question and I'll answer it. Like, oh, loud. yeah. Yep. yep. I probably do that. I tell people that I have to consult with the expert first. There we go. <laughs> That's what it is. But. Figured out. I think, I think we're done. Yeah. So, um, hopefully that was enjoyable. I don't know. I had a good time. Fingers crossed. So, <laughs> um, if you want to see more plan with us videos let me know yeah i can come back over <laughs> <laughs> we'll see maybe maybe we'll get her to start her own channel uh we will we will see <laughs> <laughs> otherwise no problem. we can always do this yes even if we're doing different kids yeah we oh i should rebuy i used the harry potter ravenclaw kit for the first week of school but I, if I'm remembering correctly, you bought the Hufflepuff. Yep, and I haven't used it. Maybe I should repurchase the Ravenclaw kit and then... Oh. Maybe I could do another That's one. a good idea. Yeah. I like that idea. I'll just do it two, two weeks in the year. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's basically it. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, subscribe. If you want to know when I post, hit the little bell for notifications. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate it. I will see you in the next video. Bye.